Hey everyone, and thanks for watching. Let's play some more Total War Rome 2 in the Roman Ascension campaign. See that? That's the Circus Maximus. You know where it is? In England. <laughs> it just cracks me up every single time. So, that's complete, finally. That's going to start giving additional wealth, additional public order. It's just going to help in a whole bunch of ways. Um, on that note, I've actually just noticed uh, that I do have some provinces... That I could potentially turn, that I could potentially start taxing again. Ooh, you are not worth it. Neither are you. Ooh, it's rough. Okay, I'll take that. That's fine. All right. So, what now? Ready for These armies, I want to ready be fully battle. ready to fight in the next turn. This army just arrived there, so we'll have to let the turn cycle. And also, I want to bring this army in as well. I want to have four armies converging on Athens, and then I want them to kind of spread out into this area and take it very rapidly as a way of kind of... As I said last time, I'm, I'm trying to, quote, neuter the Seleucid Empire. Kind of take away their power by just robbing them of, of a bunch of their territory very quickly. So they won't have as much income. And they won't be able to support their armies. This means their armies will probably make some desperate moves, but I'm okay with that. All right, so I've got some armies in position. Let's go ahead and end the turn. And then see if we can... Now, we might get attacked. We just moved some armies out of some defensive positions in these cities in northern Africa. So there could be some attacks of opportunity here. What are you doing? You're going to try and attack my agent. Okay. Athens could also do something here. No. Angiana. That's these guys. I almost just tried to point to my monitor. To show you something instead of actually moving the mouse. That would have done no good. <laughs> um, okay, this is good. I have two hidden armies. Oh, good. A Carthaginian, a small Carthaginian army is also in the middle of these two cities. That, that helps a little bit. I like it. Persia, what are you doing? You're taking a long turn. Right. Agent Def. Really? They took another agent from me? That's so stupid! See if I can't get one of these agents to go away. Okay, so I wounded one of their agents. Ugh, oh, that's annoying. They've stolen two agents from me now. You gotta be stronger willed than that, lady. Let's see if we can kill the agent they just stole. Kill her with a concealed blade. Please kill her. Please, that would be awesome. Well, nope, didn't kill her. They were able to recoup the cost of the attempt, but that's it. So we just tried to kill our defector. Traitorous wench. Seriously, that's very frustrating. They've stolen two agents from me now. Alright, so we're going to move in rapidly and take control of a couple of settlements here. So this settlement is Argila. Let's go ahead and assault it. We're fully equipped. This is Legio V Apollinaris. I don't even know if this is a member of my family. We'll find out later. The Drangiana hold this settlement. We outnumber them greatly. I'm going to try just assuming a defensive position. Ah, look at this! First time for everything. Look at this Middle Eastern style, Egyptian style architecture. Oh, it's so cool. So cool. I like it. And this is obviously, we're in the middle of a desert too. So, we're going to go ahead and attack. It's a dry day for an attack. 
let's see here. All right, so this is the back side of the city. There's no sense attacking there. That's the main capture point. So it looks similarly built to Sparta. Very similarly built, but just different types of buildings. But otherwise, there's, yeah, there's just a different temple type up here. Oh, that's so neat. I like it. Oh, that makes me sad to see, though. That reminds me of some of the... Oh. Reminds me of some of the artifacts that ISIS has destroyed in the Middle East recently. We will, by the way, be taking Palmyra um, in this game, which, of course, was a big deal a few months back. So, anyway, that's too much real talk. Let's um, see if we can just... Ooh, this general is not a horse general. He has an Avocati unit. Excellent. So we'll, we'll let him be a frontline unit. That's fine. I'm all right with that if you want to be a, a badass. So we're just going to go ahead and have... There we go. We're just going to have an army like this. Just... And then as usual, my cavalry will be ready to run at whatever. Let's go ahead and bring one unit of cavalry over here. Start the battle. To tell you guys not to fire at will, please. You guys can fire at will. And now let's see if we can coax them out of their cozy little settlement. Alright, they're definitely coming out. But I can see. Ooh, it's rough. You try and hit that Persian cavalry. this fire as centralized as possible. Awesome. Ooh, good. I like it. The battle is turning in our favor. It has been in our favor. Hush your mouth. The Romans. They don't stand a chance. <laughs> oh, that wasn't pretty. Alright, so now they are coming out to face us, which is fine. That's exactly what we wanted. Oh, oh, that, that unit just got torn up. All those horses just fell where they were. That's brutal. Split up our fire a little bit now. skirmishers are running forward. We're going to have our horses run out and take them. They're trying to lure us back there. 
The enemy general is dead. Oh, good. For glory! They already don't like their chances here. Alright, so skirmishers are now throwing. Our general is under attack. Really? Oh, yeah, because he's a frontliner. Good. They're giving us the victory. Let's go ahead and halt these guys. Get these guys to do some chasing. That doesn't do any good. Let's have these guys come back. So that was easy. Took control of Aguila with relative ease. Haven't even entered the city yet. Matter of fact, all these guys are getting mopped up. Let's let's march up top. Hillman. So a lot of their largest units are still here running away, but I've got some horses in front of them. While my army is marching into town, Charge! these guys are getting torn up. Is coming in from the back here. Oh, wait. Finish them off first. Ooh. So they just got knocked down. Still getting torn up, that's good. This is actually several... The reason I'm doing this is this is a couple hundred men that are all running away. These look Greek. These units look Greek. Interesting. So some leftover technology maybe from the Macedonian era. Or at least some leftover... Uh, influence. Guys, <laughs> there's this 
Just this contingent of swordsmen that keeps getting away from those cavalry. That's not working the way it's supposed to. excited. They're doing some conquering. They're excited. This is where the initial battle happened. Goodness. All of these deaths are like artillery deaths. Everybody you see here just got hit by a rock. <laughs> God, they got just like, demolished. Alright, I'm happy with that. Let's go ahead and quit. Dragged on that hunting period a bit too long. We lost 14 met. Only lost 14 men. It's like seven and a half percent. No, it's more than seven and a half, my bad. Sorry, I'm sitting here thinking about it. Like, wait a minute, that's not right. So the general leveled up and the army leveled up. That's good. So let's give him... Again, let's give him the additional damage powers as well. Clodius Kipio. Yes! You are a member of my family! That's great! And an established member of my family. That's wonderful. All right. Promote him want these people to be the ones doing the fighting. It's excellent. Now, question of the day, Mike. Yes, I am! I see the little yellow border. I will be able to march all the way to Peritonian. Hopefully there's not a huge defending army. <laughs> there's not! Excellent. They're not ready for me. Oh, shoot. Maybe they are. Who is... Who are these guys? Interesting. I don't see an army that's reinforcing them, but... The, the game is saying there's an army reinforcing them. Okay. Well, if you want to play that game... We'll move this fleet in range. It'll leave Serene unprotected... Which is dangerous, but I don't think they have an army ready to do anything. Now let's see if that helped. Yes, that did help. Excellent. In the next episode, I'll go ahead and take Peritonian from them and see how that goes. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in a bit.